The Atelmo Historic Preservation Commission is working to let residents know more about the history of their community. Atelmo has six historical districts listed on the National Register. Bogle Place, the Atelmo Cemetery, Court Hill, 5th Street Bluff, the Railroad District downtown, and a post-World War II development neighborhood. And Bogle Place was known as the first suburb of Atumwa. It's kind of a streetcar and autom automobile-oriented neighborhood, uh, middle-class neighborhood. Saturday, the Historic Preservation Commission took residents on a tour of Bogle Place, and they say the best way to see any district is on foot. And if anyone from the 1920s came back to the historical district, they would remember it just as it was back then. It is part of our past. It's how Atumwa developed. The Historic Preservation Commission is looking at adding two more districts to the National Register. We have one downtown. Um, we've identified a district on East 2nd Street um, that will hopefully be listed this fall. And then uh, with the development of uh, the Blackbird uh, developers out on St. Joe, um, that will be its own uh, historic district as well. Identifying a historical district requires certain criteria and a lot of hard work. First, there's a survey done. It can be an architectural style uh, development uh, that's important to uh, Atumwa. The people that live there, lots of different um, things can make it an important area. But really, what, what the big thing is, is that it has to have that sense of time and place. And members with the Historic Preservation Commission say having these historical districts is an important way to remember how Atumwa developed. It's certainly a valuable, uh, almost economically too, because I think people come to Atumwa to see those things, and, and it shows potential people coming to Atumwa how, how you care for your old things, and I think that's important too. Reporting in Atumwa, Iowa, Alex Wilson, KTVO News.